time in boys and girls time to do chapter three game of is in secret x mail reader chapter three gain the letter tony logwitz josh norris promo i got up to make breakfast for myself and when i got out of bed i went to my walk-in closet i saw more that my clothes were overnight i smiled picked out an outfit and i put it on and this morning i went to my main room and then went to the kitchen of the house and started to make something to eat. I smiled and saw that there was food already made. I think someone was here in my house. I brought my gun and headed to the mother, into places of my house and got to my brother's office of the house of my house and opened the door and pointed the gun at and saw this. Brother, why the, are you here? I asked him. Brother, put your gun down. It is just me. Do you eat your breakfast? I said my brother Gilbert. No, brother, I was shocked you put food for me. I spoke. I'm sorry you had to get PTSD attack, brother. Said my brother Gilbert. It's okay, I'm sorry I pulled a gun on you. I spoke. It's okay, said my brother Gilbert. So what do you want? So what? Wanting to have breakfast with me? I spoke. Sure, let's go to the little brother, said my brother Gilbert. We got to the kitchen and I smiled and made something for my brother Gilbert. And I smiled and he was sat in the kid table and I was done and I took my food and his food to the table. I smiled and we got to eat and the doorbell rang. I went to the door and there was a letter on the doorstep. I smiled, it was a nice, and I went to the dining room table and sat on the chair and looked at my brother. He gave me the signal to open it. So I did. I opened it and I found out that it was a disc. I touched the button and a picture of my dad came up. Hello, my younger son, Toy. This is... Me, as a VR simulation of your father, I wanted to say the of your score of the end of exam. So here we go. You got three, four, five hundred points against the villain's points. For saving the heroes, Antilia gave you hundred points. Cammy Woods gave you 120 points. Minnie gave you 200 points. And I gave you a 300 points. In rescue points, saving does zero pointers. So the points equal to this. 3, 5, 22, 20, 20, 22, 20. 3, 5, 20 points. So you are in first place. A new record in the higher school of UA High. Welcome to the Your Hero Academia. When you are part of the week three, and this is also part of the being the president of UA High. So you have a good day, and son, and your brother is home. Don't try to shoot him, said my dad. And then I smiled, and my brother hugged me, and he kissed my, he and he, and he hugged me, and he smiled and kissed. Well, I smiled, and my brother hugged me, and he smiled and kissed my head. Good job, brother. You finally made yourself a better hero in that school. I learned more as a hero, said my brother Gilbert. Thank you, brother Gilbert. Brother Gilbert. After calls, you can going to go and check on them. I spoke. Go and do that. I will call our family, said my brother Gilbert. I smiled and I went to my office and saw that I needed to go, go need to grab my phone off the desk and call Chaco first. I smiled and saw that Chaco was smiling. So I chuckled smiling. I heard a file ring and then a scream. Tony, you got it in the first place, said Chaco. I know Chaco. I made history for all of UA High. I spoke. And you are the president of UA High and part of the Big Three as a first year, said Chaco. I know I, and I had a happy. And I am happy that you are proud of me, I spoke. Yes, I'm proud of you. We brought it. You, of you, of you, bro of you, or bro is your brother? Bro of you, your bro. So is your brother really home from the war? So asked Joko. Yeah, he is back from the war, I spoke. Can I meet him someday? So asked Joko. 
Yeah, no, you can just let me ask him if he is able to meet someone. Pe some people I spoke. All right, I will talk to you later. Did you have to talk to your boyfriend? Said Chaco. Yeah, I have to. I spoke. Talk to you later. Bye. Said Chaco. Talk to you later. Bye as well. I spoke. She ended up in a smile and hit the Ziggler's number and waited for the rain. For it to rain. The fire rain and the, I heard my brain's voice. Hello, love. Said Ziggler. Hello, Cupcake. I spoke. So I found out you got first place and you had a world record for UA High and you are the president of UA High. You are part of the big three in the first year and you are also having your brother back in Japan from the war, said Zuko. Yeah, I know. I heard that Chaka wants to meet my brother. Do you and your mom want to meet my big brother, Bill Gilbert? I spoke. Yes, I would love to, said Zuko. Okay, we'll ask him. I spoke. So, how are you doing, my love? Says, ask Zuko. I'm doing fine. I spoke. So, can I go on a date with you? Asked Zuko. Sure, I know a place so we can go. I spoke. Text me where we to go and when we are can have our date. Says Zuko. I will do that. I spoke. So, it's, it's time for me to go. My mom is calling me. Oh, and Choco, I got into the school. As well, Chaka wanted me to say that to you, says Zuko. Cool, I, I will see you guys in the school, I spoke. I'll see the little one to see you, and Chaka as well. See you in school in April, said Zuko. Yeah, see you in April. I hope you have fun on the break till you go to school, said to I spoke. Talk to you later, my love, said Zuko. Talk to you later, lovely, I spoke. Bye, love, said Zuko. Bye, lovely, I spoke. We ended the call and I headed to my, uh, to my room and saw that there was a present in my bed. I opened it and it was uh, the UA you high uniform in a uniform style. I smiled and tried it on and I smiled and then I put it in my walk-in closet. I then went to the living room to see my brother and my watch TV. I then smiled and saw my dad sitting on the chair watching TV as well. Hello, son, said Dad. Hello, Dad, I spoke. So you are ready for April? Asked Dad. I smiled and it was time for me to make something to eat for a snack. I then went to back to the living room and watched TV and saw what it was, do was doing and saw that it was something Big Brother would watch. I smiled, sat on the chair and watched what brother was watching while eating my snack. He was looking at me and I gave him a look and said, no, look, no, and he stopped. I then finished my snack and went to do my paperwork for my country. And smile laid my head on down after I'd done the paperwork with the paperwork. I didn't hear that it was lunchtime, so I went to get my lunch for my dad and I finished my lunch and it was time to get some training done. I finished my training session and then I lay down and smiled and looked at my phone and went to text for everyone I know from all the countries texted me telling me a good job. I smiled and text back that I am thankful they helped me in my training in their own ways. I smiled and I went then went back to bed and I fell asleep. I then heard my dad come into the room and lay in my bed. I fell asleep as well. I smiled in my sleep and my bro took a picture of this. I smiled and laid my head in my dad's chest. My dad smiled in sleep. How would life would be for me in their lives and then their next lives as pro hero as in a soldier in a country for other people. I smiled and hugged my dad and he smiled and hugged me as well. Now I feel like I can be a hero like my dad, a better hero than him.